Okay, so I'm going to show you how you can mass email um, through Streak. So what you want to do, um, I already have people selected from my last video that I want to mass email about the sale on 21 Day Fix because that's what they had been interested in in the past. You can see that over here. Um, and I showed you how I looked that up through the tagging columns. So I'm going to click more and send mass mail merge. You can see there's eight boxes selected and only four emails extracted. That's because four of these people I had been emailing or I have their email address and uh, four other people are people who I was communicating with on Facebook. So I'll at least have four people that I got to email. So click continue with mail merge. Okay. It's actually three because um, those people didn't count. And so what will end up happening is I can pre-select one of my um, messages here, or I can just type a new message. I can even customize the template. I could say, hey, um, and I, I could use, let me click here. I could use uh, their name, full name. Probably won't want to do that because it may not come up correctly. Let me see if it will. Yeah, so it's going to put their full name, so I don't really want to do that. Um, let me see if it will. Wish it did first name. Maybe it does. Nah, we don't. So I don't want to do that because it may not show up right. Um, but I can just say, hey, I know you were just in the 21 day fix. So there we go, and then I can click to send that um, right now, and it's going to send it to those three people. I'm not going to do that right now because I actually already did that recently. Um, and then the other people who weren't on here, usually I will have their um, Facebook linked if I was talking to them on Facebook. So it's very easy for me to just click here, go to their Facebook, and invite them. Um, so you can kind of see how easy that is. Once I have sent that message, I'll actually put them an invite date next to it to let myself know that I invited them. If I followed up with them in the past, I'm gonna erase this and um, leave it as blank so that I can remember to follow up with them later. Um, something else that you can do, which is awesome, let me clear this, and it's something that I just did not too long ago, <laughs> this last week, um, is I sent mass email to all of these people, so, any past interest, invited them all to my challenge group. So everybody in the free group, everybody that had past interest in being um, in one of my challenge groups and all of my customers. And so I went to send a message to them. So send mass mail merge. You see that it extracted 108 emails and it only left out 124. Continue with mail merge. And then I just want to remove any that it tells me may not be right. And then there's other people I might want to remove if I see something that's like myself. <laughs> Let me drop this out. There we go. So, okay. Now, I don't want to leave that up because that is personal information of people's. Um, but I, in, I invited all of those people and um, invited them to my group. And I, I actually invited more than this. I ended up inviting like 200 people in less than eight minutes. And so you can actually see, so sent mail here. You can actually see where it says you're invited, everybody who has seen it, um, and the people who I sent this to over the weekend. And so I had a lot of interest in it. I would say, you know, the majority of people who saw it wrote back to me. Um, now, not everybody's going to see it. And it was a couple days ago, so maybe they'll see it later. But I usually do get, um, you know, a pretty good open response rate on email. I don't usually have an issue with that. So that's kind of how you can um, use your mail merge or what we call the, um, yeah, it's mail merge or mass email. So you can send mass email. Now, with Gmail, they usually say that you can only email, um, and you can see I've still got some people I need to respond to from that email. Um, with Gmail, they limit that to, I think, I want to say 200 
a day. You'll have to look into it because I can't remember how many you can do a day, but you have to be careful not to um, overextend that or they might freeze your account for a day or something um, because it might look like spam. But I've been able to send at least 200, you know, in one day before with no issues. Uh, so that is how I use the, the mail merge or the send the mass email. And the way that um, I find people to email or follow up with uh, is usually using those column trackers that I was just showing you how to set up. So I hope that helps, and I hope that this system works for you. Bye, guys.